trade jobs are in high demand right now, but there are just not enough people to fill the jobs. And that's why the city of Newport News created a program to find workers and help at-risk youth at the same time. News 3 reporter Ellen I shows us how it's changing young lives on the peninsula. Here in Newport News, there is a program that allows at-risk youth the opportunity to learn a trade like carpentry and join the job site like you see behind me. I'm able to um, do the one thing I always wanted to do growing up, and that was to be able to work with construction. 19-year-old Michael Diaz is a graduate of the Youth Build program. After six months of training, he's now a carpenter and site superintendent, working with Breed and Construction in Newport News. To me, it's important because it got me out of a dark space. We do not want them to have adverse uh, situations in their lives, so we give them various opportunities, and youth build is that opportunity. Director Daniel Carrera says young adults ages 16 to 24 can qualify. Some of the criteria includes youth in foster care, those previously incarcerated, and high school dropouts. Get them out of harm's way uh, and give them something they can use for the rest of their lives, a skill, a trade, and things of that nature. The graduates are also filling a need skilled trades jobs on the peninsula. We're always looking for more workers kind of on our job sites um, and there's really a high demand for it at the moment. While learning important skills for the future. They help me become more confident in myself and help me become a team leader. For more information on Youth Build, head to our website, WTKR.com. In Newport News, Ellen Ice, News 3.